Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is a cleaning in my kitchen and we are working on my oven uh, like stove top and you're going to see how I was able to successfully get all of this nasty uh, like melted on I don't even know what it was on my stove top I was not able to get it off with any other products except for the one that I have in this video and it's a very inexpensive way to clean um, I just got it from Walmart so I'm going to share that with you later in this video so right now I'm just going through and doing some cleaning of the dishes you guys know if you have been on my channel before I hate cleaning the dishes so my motivation to get it done was to film it for you guys so as you guys know I have a cleaning channel I'm here all about cleaning and getting things done and giving you all motivation but honestly me filming and providing motivation for you guys does motivate myself as well so thank you guys for being here and watching my channel because it does help motivate me to get things done so the purpose of me cleaning all of these instead of putting them in the dishwasher is because we were just meal prepping for our meals for the week. Um, I had made ground turkey with spinach and some seasonings and I wanted to put those into containers but all of the containers were dirty so I forced myself to uh, clean all of the dishes so that's what I'm doing here and I figured I might as well film it and share it with you guys so if you have a lot of dishes to get done and cleaned then you can clean along with me. I know you've been down thinking about him again I know that your heart's been broken You should try and let it go and start being yourself You, you Don't need to be ashamed Everyone's got their hearts broken sometime Let's go out and lose our minds Forget all about him You, you to my channel I would love to introduce myself thank you first off for being here and if you're not new to my channel thank you so much for coming back time and time again to watch my videos it really does mean the world to me so my name is Jessica and I am very very pregnant in this video by the time that I have this video live my son will definitely already be here I I am five days away as I'm editing this video. I'm five days away from having him. So I am very pregnant <laughs> in this video. And we are having a boy. 
and I'm sure I have already announced his name by now, but his name is Nolan John Ekin. So anyways, I am so happy to share that with you guys, and I can't wait to share more about mom life as I grow into that season of life. Um, but anyways, so it's just myself and my husband and our dog, Sadie, and we built our home we built it in 2019 and we moved in two days before Christmas. Um, so really our whole entire 2000, or I'm sorry, not 2019, 2020, um, two days before Christmas. And then the entire 2021, we lived in the our, our new home and I started making cleaning videos once we moved into our new home. And I have just loved making these cleaning videos for you guys. It is so much fun for me. I do this as like just a fun thing. I, I do work full time as a mortgage loan officer. And I'm licensed in every state in the United States. Um, and my husband, he also works full time. Um, and he is an electrician um, working on getting his master electrician license. So we have very busy lives. He also coaches soccer uh, on the side as well as like part time job. So he is full time plus part time plus goes to school to get his master's license. And then I work full time and we're having a baby. So our life is pretty busy, I would say. Um, and then I fit in making cleaning videos as well as like a fun thing for like a hobby for myself to do. So if you're new to my channel, you will see a ton of cleaning motivation. I do whole house clean with me's, um, nest with me as I was getting ready, preparing for our first child. Um, and then you will always see, as you can see right here, my dog Sadie in every single cleaning video. She's always here to clean with me. As you guys can see, this is a total disaster, and my husband got me this at Walmart, so I'm really hoping that it works. It's for the stovetop. Um, it's like a cleaning cooktop kit, and I have some stuff that is like... I don't know if it melted on there or what, but I cannot get it off. So I'm really hoping that these products will work. And then I'm going to clean the rest of the counter with my Jaws Granite Counter Cleaner. Um, so let's first get all these crumbs up. I need to wait for the cooktop to cool down and then we'll try to get those spots out. No more, we don't know, no more, 
us no more, we don't know, no us no more, no, no We don't know, no us no more, we don't know, no us no more, we don't know, no us no more sure if this was going to work and I was kind of getting discouraged and then I just put a little bit more pressure onto the surface and I was able to get up everything oh my gosh it was incredible and my husband said later he thinks that I was supposed to put the solution down first but I did not do that so as you can see here is all the gunk that I got up it was disgusting um, but I did not put that solution down first so maybe I should have done that and it probably would have been a little bit easier for myself um, but I didn't I just took that little um, I'm gonna call it a razor I don't really know what else to call it and I just started scraping it did not cut my surface at all. It did a fantastic job. I got every single thing up that was on my stovetop. And this is an electric, like, flat stovetop, by the way, as you can tell. Um, but it did such a great job, and my husband just got it from Walmart. I am so happy to report that this razor just got off all of that stuff that was stuck on here. I am so happy about that. <laughs> so then I just sprayed this on top. But what I'm going to do now is I am going to use this heavy duty solution like pretty much on every single one of these circles and then i'm going to use this little scrubber over top of the solution it's rather soft it's not like a hard material um i'm gonna just rub that over top and oh here's the handle for it um i'm gonna rub that over top and hopefully just get it all like nice and really clean and then i'm gonna spray this one more time and that'll be it. So first step was this. Second step is the glass cleanser. And then the last step, I'm going to do this. So very, very happy. This was a very inexpensive solution to getting this nice and clean because I could not get anything else to work.
I've been just picking up, 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 picking up,
hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. I know it was a rather short one, but sometimes all you need is a little bit of motivation to get the things done that you want to get done. So thank you so much for being here. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up on your way out, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye! They keep saying I'll be fine, but how you know that I'll be there when it feels like I'm